People of all ages, racial backgrounds and nationalities live, work and play together. Here, people transcend all demographics. Little wonder then that here, you will find an incredibly energetic city with a pulse that is unmatched anywhere else on earth. Johannesburg's inner city decay was indeed initiated by the need for more efficient buildings and the obvious choice for property developers was the more affordable land in the northern suburbs. This land was also closer to the well-heeled business customer base whose lamented traveling through gridlock traffic to the city where among other things parking space was problematic. By the late 1980s, the exodus of corporate business and large retailers from Johannesburg's inner city was well underway. The flight from the city was made all the more striking by the political uncertainty of that period. Until 1990, Johannesburg stood proudly at the epic center of South Africa's apartheid economy. On the surface, the city was a flourishing metropolis with a pumping capitalist economy. But behind the scenes, most of the workforce lived in poverty, 